We're coming up to Campsite 13 on Cranberry Lake in St. Lawrence County, New York. Campsite's on the north shore of East Inlet, fairly far into the bay. The bottom here is cobble. It'll be pretty hard on a boat hull. When I came up, I stopped before I bottomed the boat, climbed out, got a wet foot. Somebody came in here in an aluminum boat because there are some stones here with silver scraped across the top. There's a short little path from the shore up to the campsite. It's a fairly open and large campsite. There is a picnic table and somebody has some logs that are cut to use for stools. It's level. It's fairly well drained. We've had three inches of rain in the past three days and I don't see any muddy spots. From behind the fire ring your view is basically to the southwest. That's the direction the prevailing winds come from. There's a little bit of a screen from the breeze by the trees and undergrowth along the shore in that direction. There's a tent pad to the west. To the left of the fire pit there's a grassy area that looks as if it could also be a good tent pad. So we have one to the east and one to the west. Sunset would be through the trees in that direction for most of the summer. Likewise, sunrise would be through the trees from the northeast most of the summer in that direction. The site will be well shaded. Though it does have a southern exposure, you can get behind the trees and get into the trees and under the shade. You will have a view of the stars directly overhead. The prevailing winds will come up the length of the lake, so you can get some good-sized waves building up on this shore coming in in a canoe or kayak. It's just a good practice to always pull it all the way up on the shore. You'll be able to hear the waves on the shore at night if you're camping at this site and there's a breeze. The site's very well screened from other campsites. Looking to the southwest at night, there are some private properties in that direction. You may be able to see lights over the water from that direction. Fair amount of poison ivy around the site, so be aware of that. There is poison ivy along the trail leading to the privy. Screens are intact. It has a translucent roof, so you have some light during the daytime. The toilet seat's in good shape. The trail to the privy continues on and links up to a segment of the Cranberry Lake 50 trail. Because you're in a stand of small deciduous trees, mostly beach, you'll have to walk a long way to find a bear hang. On the back side of the point that the campsite occupies. There is a narrow shallow bay. I imagine that'll generate a fair number of bugs.